it is insane how fast you can go from zero to a full stack production app with Next.js and Kiramase. Let me show you. So we're going to create a new Next.js app. We're going to call this Quick Deploy. Uh, we are going to say yes to everything here. We're using App Router, TypeScript, and Tailwind CSS. Let's uh, jump into that project. We're going to run Kiramase init. We're going to use Shadzian UI, Drizzle, Postgres, Vercel Postgres, Lucia v3, and that's it. Finishing configuration, uh, copying some files in, installing some packages, and then we'll be installing some Shadzian UI components. In the meantime, let's go to uh, the browser and let's create a new database. Uh, we are going to call this Quick quick deploy, create, perfect. Let's head to the env.local, copy that snippet, head back to the browser. We're gonna jump in, head to the EMV, and we are going to copy down those uh, values. We're also gonna paste in, uh, just replace this database URL, perfect. So let's run bun db generate. We follow these instructions here. So bun db generate, bun db migrate, and then we should be good to go. So let's add everything to git, then we're gonna run gh repo create local. Uh, we're gonna call this quick deploy, uh, public. Yes, yes, yes. Awesome, so now all we should have to do is head back to Vercel, uh, head to a workspace, hit add new project. We are gonna select that brand new uh, project. We are going to paste in our environment variables. Uh, so if we go down, paste, uh, copy them in here, and then we are going to hit deploy. And then in about 30 seconds, we should be up and running. So while this is happening, I will mention that Kiramase is a lot like ShadCN UI, but on the level of a full stack application. So what's happening behind the scenes is that we've modularized each of these components, and then we effectively just paste them into your project. And so what that means is that you get all of this production ready code, um, but that you can do anything you want with it. There are no libraries, there are no abstractions. So you can see um, we have layout groups and um, within your layout groups, we're checking off. These are things that are just things you would have done otherwise, but are done for you by default. Um, so if we head back here, should be deployed. And there we go. So here's our project. Wait for the confetti, yay. Head over, you can see that this is deployed on Vercel, quick deploy red. Uh, let's sign in. Zoom in a bit, we can try with a fake thing. You can see incorrect username and password. Obviously we haven't created any accounts. We do t at test.com. And you can see that this has browser validation built in as well, invalid email, t at test.com. Let's make it test one, two, three, sign up. And boom, we're in, we've got an application. We have got uh, everything responsive right out of the box. And uh, we've even got, we can update our session. We've got Sonar Toasts. It's all just, it just works. And we've got light and dark mode ready to go. So yeah, this is it. This is how fast you can do it. And uh, I hope you can use this to help kickstart your many ideas that you wanna push into production. So yeah, have fun.